Hello, I'm Tom Colville, and I'd like to show you this painting on my left here by the American genre painter Eastman Johnson. It's entitled Crossing a Stream and dates from 1866. Now, Johnson, during the Civil War, was notable for uh, painting African-American subjects and uh, war subjects. Uh, and after the war, he turned more to domestic scenes such as the painting in the National Gallery, which this is sort of a pendant to, entitled uh, Picking Water Lilies from 1865 and this picture from 1866, uh, both of which he exhibited in Philadelphia on successive years. Now, uh, it's been remarked to me that this picture looks very much like Winslow Homer, and I wanted to address that because Winslow Homer, at the time this was painted, was only 29 years old. He was just emerging on the scene, having painted the prisoners from the front. And it was in fact Eastman Johnson who proposed Winslow Homer for membership in the Century Association, which was a great help for his career. And they became uh, sort of friendly competitors after that. But this uh, painting uh, is really a mature example of Eastman Johnson's uh, best work. Now, I want to say that the picture is extraordinary and is set apart from other genre works of the time, such as by uh, J.G. Brown, in the psychological uh, quality of the subjects and the way it is presented. As you can see, the mother is uh, choosing her footwork very carefully as she crosses the stream. We don't know how deep the, the uh, stream is or where that log leads and the child is apprehensively her, her child is looking off to the right he's not very comfortable with this and yet the artist treats the landscape as a just a beautiful place where they want to be the way he paints the flowers wildflowers in the bank and the reflections and the uh, lichen in the water is given equal weight and quality to the figures which have their psychological uh, relationship and it conveys uh, a sense of place but it also conveys a state of mind and uh, in those two qualities combined together I think uh, creates a beautiful convincing work of art that is, uh, that is extraordinary in quality.